Ah, oh, my back is killing me. Shigo, why did I let you talk me out of buying the model with heated seats and lumbar support? Because it also had a sunroof, which on a subterranean vehicle seemed a little, I don't know, pointless. I'll become even more brilliant. Perhaps ridiculously brilliant. Certainly brilliant enough to design my own doomsday weapon. Let's charge her up. Ah! Patient Chico. First, we must document this historic moment in my quest for world domination. Here, use this. It came free with the test drive. Ah, wait, I wasn't ready. Try again. Impossible! Every time you barge in, I just... Ah, the anger and the... Yeah. And now, Shiko, I shall use my newly acquired brilliance to begin the design of my doomsday device. Uh -huh. I can feel my brilliance blossoming. It's as if my hand is but a humble servant to the power of my advanced mind. Ah! So what do you think? Um, nothing personal, but it doesn't exactly scream doomsday or brilliance. Hmm. Ah! Hmm. Nonsense. It must be so advanced that your own puny intellect cannot grasp it. Take a look at this one. A puppy and a horsey. Cute. Okay, Shigo. Feast your eyes on this vision of doomsday genius. Ooh, try again, Picasso. Oh, it doesn't make sense. I was in the chair. The beam surged. We all saw it. Why am I not... More brilliant. Brilliant -er. More brilliant -er. Unstoppable. Help me out. Kim Possible's dopey sidekick. Since when is he a genius? I'm the one that... Wait a second. That boy has my brains. And I want them back. Shush, boy. Now is not the time for words. Now is the time for action. Well, actually, thought. Yes, now is the time for thought, followed soon after by action. Say, now might be a great time to take that super freak singles cruise you've been thinking about. That doomsday device better work. Otherwise, you'll be swimming with the fish. Fish, right? Or is it fishes? Fish or fishes. Well, which is it? Both are correct plural forms of the singular word fish. You're very smug right now, aren't you? A little bit. Ah! Well, Mr. Stoppable, have fun with the fish. Or fishes. <laughs> Don't try and trick me, boy. I know Kim Possible when I see her. Yeah, the lame outfit is always a dead giveaway. This isn't over, Kim Possible. You capture us, we'll just come back more evil than before. It's eviler. More eviler, less not gooder. I... Please stop talking. Okay. Cancel that order. Good morning, Dr. Freeman. Stop! What happened? You know, for someone who's supposedly a mad genius, I'm not seeing much of the genius. Keep it up, Shigo, and you'll see plenty of the mad. Ooh, scary man. Um, you're going to help me, Dr. Freeman, with a little problem I'm having. And pay for my dry cleaning as well. This factory once manufactured family station wagons, but I've twisted it. My parents had a station wagon. Went to sock hops and soda parlors in it. Oh, neato. Where was I? Twisted it. I've twisted it to a grander purpose. A far more insidious threat. A much deadlier... He's building an army of robots. Why do you do that? The evil rant is one of the best perks of the job. Yeah, well, it's boring, so, so you know. But you... Ah! Bring in the destructor bots! You didn't want to do this, Doctor! But you force my hand! Help me, please! Come on, do me a solid! This guy won't help us because he can't help us! Diego, what are you saying? The man's a genius! The world's leading expert on computerized automation! If he really knew his stuff, he'd fix your robots and be on his merry way! Right, Dr. Draken? Huh? Oh, I see. Yes, you're right. This Freeman clearly is a poser. What? Yeah, we should have grabbed some other scientist. Yes, perhaps somebody from Lowerton Community College. Those hacks. I can program circles around those buffoons. You talk the talk. Prove it. Bet you can't fix my death ray either. Hey, don't, don't push it. Can you not? Nah. Reckon, release Dr. Freeman. Are they partying? Ah, I told you I could do it. I know I told you you could do it. I never doubted you. Kim 
people in that sporty utility vehicle are destroying my robots! And that's why you have me around. Real nice. Well, my robot army was a failure. But at least Kim Possible won't be around to ruin my future schemes. See? Always a silver lining. Yes. <laughs> you hear something? Impossible! You think your car's all that, but it's not! Simple, Shigo. Once I've shrunk to microscopic size, I will be able to infiltrate the most secretive military installation in the world. Area 51. And what's an Area 51 that's so special? You know, flying saucers, alien technology, yada, yada, yada. Coming up, puddles not now. Can't you see Daddy's trying to put the finishing touches on his shrink ray? Yeah, he needs to go out. He was just out ten minutes ago. Now, what did we agree on? <sighs> if I wanted a dog, I had to promise to take care of him, which I will. Later. Whoa! It's not supposed to do that. It's supposed to shrink stuff. Told you he had to go out. Mine! It's all mine! It... Oh, I'm sorry. Is this yours? I was just borrowing it, you know. <laughs> really? Here you go, Chief. One stolen battery thing. Feliz Navidad. Excellent, Shigo. Track Force One is complete. And this time, Kim Possible will not get in the way. Okay, why is that? Because it is Christmas. The one time of the year she is off duty. Busy with her twinkle lights and mistletoe and carols and roast beast and frim franglers and zoob zooblers. Oh, 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 Dr. D. What? You've stopped using words. Oh. Right. Right. Where's the sunblock? In the mudroom. Wait, what do you want sunblock for? Uh, I'm on vacation now, remember? But don't you want to stay to see the culmination of everything we've been working toward? Chigo. Chigo. Uh, Fine. I'll get me some me time. Soon, I, Dr. Draken, will rule the Yule. The world will have a blue Christmas. <laughs> it's just not the same when I ran to myself. Finally, a holiday where I get what I want. Total global domination. This is going to be the best Christmas ever. Commencing landing sequence. All right, got it on the first try, not bad. Commencing takeoff sequence. Commencing landing sequence. Commencing takeoff sequence. Commencing landing sequence. Commencing takeoff sequence. Commencing landing sequence. Commencing takeoff. Commencing, commencing. Please make up your mind. Initiating bedtime sequence. Wait a second, what was that? I don't know what you're talking about. Before the teddy bear! Self-destruct in 20. God, what did you do? This is my chance to rule the world! All I want is what's coming to me! All I want is my fair share! Self-destruct! Self-destruct! My fault? It's not my fault! This is so your fault! What? I'm supposed to let you take over the world? In the spirit of the season, yes! Oh! You want to throw things now! Ow! Stop it! Please, I'm on vacation. Uh, my food! food! Nah. Uh, went to voicemail. Um, hello, Shigo, Dr. Uh, Draken. No. I hope you're having a nice it's vacation. Oh, uh, when you get the chance, could you get up here to the North Pole and save me? Please! It's cold and windy and dark, and we've got nothing to... That's my chicken! Hey, you threw it away. Oh. Mm, thanks. Here you go. No need. It's all been paid for. It has? By who? A gentleman called and said he would cover your whole vacation. Shigo, just my way of saying thanks for a super year and Merry Christmas. Yours an evil Dr. Dragon. Oh, that is so nice. Guess I should have taken his call. Oh, maybe he left a message. Ah, name your price, stoppable power. Glory, when I take over the world, you can have a continent, any continent, not Europe. You're a fan of Snowman Hank? I'm taping it. Dude, didn't you hear? They canceled it. 
No, no, never! It's true. I can tell you this. In the little TV in my heart, Snowman Hank will play forever. If we survive, the memory of Snowman Hank will survive. For Snowman Hank! Snowman Hank. Are you ready to be extreme? Yeah, extremely annoyed. I need a snowmobile. We're using him to be extreme. This'll do. Hey, aren't you supposed to be home bobbing for cider? Something? Not without Ron. Loser! <laughs> Are you too finished? Because I am not. Nonsense. We were just about to sit down to dinner. Dinner's not extreme. Yes, it is. I made cupcakes. Uh, Dr. D? Are you serious? Of course, because to the people far and near, Snowman, Snowman Hank brought holiday cheer. cheer. This is, this is, I, I don't know what this is. Look who's under the mistletoe. Well, really it's small parsley I found in the dumpster, but oh. Possibles, join us, won't you? Isn't that Kimberly Ann's arch foe? Tis the season. Of course, once we enter the new year, the truce is over. I'm going to open a bag of freak on all of you. Thank you for falling for it. Hook, line, and sinker. I told you, Shigo. This, this is, is my, my greatest, greatest plan, plan yet. Yeah, like the bar was set so high. With this teleportation module, I shall be able to instantly transport myself into any high security area I please. Imagine it, Seiko. The sky's the limit, Fort Knox, the Louvre. Or into the 10 items or less line with 11 items, huh? Exactly! Wait, was that a serious suggestion or are you mocking me? Yeah, I'd say about 30% serious, 70% mock. Ah, plug it in! Oh, where's the universal teleportation adapter? I'm guessing not here. Blast! You sent a hero to do a villain's work, and this is what you get. All right, I'll infiltrate Dementor's fortress and get it. Don't wait up. I've got the source of the hack. No, you don't. Ah, uh, well, you're the fake. It's Draken. <laughs> Ever hear of knocking? Okay, first, you'll be sealed in a reinforced titanium box. Next. You will be dropped into this bottomless chasm. Then, the chasm will be filled with water. Then, man-eating sharks and a giant squid will then be released into the water! Huh. Well, wait. If the chasm is bottomless, how can you fill it with water? It's very, very deep, all right! Hey, lastly, I shall freeze over the top of the water with a six-foot layer of solid glacial ice. <laughs> Any questions? Not if you're gonna get all snippy. Now that really ought to do it. Mint, here we come! We're sorry, your call cannot be completed as dial. Uh, what do you have to do, dial nine? You better answer it. Never fails. I hate call waiting. Hello! Mother, not now. I'm very busy. He'll call you back. But how did... I mean, the change and... Then a shark and then a squid and then the ice wall. I, oh, I thought for sure this time you. Can we get back to Shigo for a minute? Your sister? And at one time, a fellow hero. Shigo, good? She and I and the rest of our family, we were Team Go. <laughs> good times, good times. We kept Go City safe from evil, but the more we fought evil, the more Shigo liked it. The fighting? The evil. Right. Oh, how'd you get your powers? It began when we were children. Lady Fate came a-knockin', and she knocked hard. What was that? A glowing, rainbow-colored comet that gave each of us special powers. I knew it was destiny. No, 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 really, I'm listening. Go on. This rare mutagenic agent that you stole from me will unlock the key to... Knock, knock. Impossible! Since when do you glow? Like he go. I believe some introductions are in order here. Can you excuse us, Dr. D? 
Chico, as long as you're going to live under my roof, you'll follow my rules. And rule number one, no secrets. Whatever is going on... ...is obviously a private matter. Later, Gators. You know, I do think of us as a kind of evil family. And families stick together. So if you need me, I'll be there for you. Looks like all of my least favorite people in the world have gotten together to form a club. Why? I think so. You've got a giant view screen that your archfo can appear on whenever he wants. He talks to you, you talk to him. You don't think? That he could use that technology to spy on us while we were planning our heroic efforts. Blast! The Fiend! How come no one ever mentioned this before? Because it was obvious. <sighs> ah! There is no way I can do this! Five minutes with my brothers and I'm ready to claw my own eyes out! You can't walk out! Why not? Because if you don't help, I'll tell the world that you used to be a good guy. <gasps> you wouldn't. I've got a website and I'm not afraid to use it. My reputation would be shot! <sighs> Kim? Is she go in your kitchen? Just do your computer thing, nerdlinger. Has she always been this cranky? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Not gonna happen. Ooh, the complete set is within reach. <laughs> Need a little help? Are you offering? All right, look, I just don't want to lose to a giant flamingo, okay? You hit him high? And you hit him low. <laughs> you ladies talk too much. Oh. See, this is why I hate family reunions. No! Sucka. Or I could have all the powers. Chigo, I thought we were in this together. Oh, come on. Don't you know me better by now? I mean... <laughs> Seriously. She's right. Yeah, keeping everyone else's power for herself and using them for evil. Yeah, that's got more of the Shigo vibe. No, I don't believe it. You may be a cranky smart mouth prone to excessive violence, but deep down, you are still a member of Team Go, a hero. Higo, I quit your stupid team years ago, and after I quit, I went to work for a guy who wants to take over the world. <gasps> it's true. But deep down... I am evil! Have I made myself clear? Oh, I could have used all the powers at once? <gasps> Dr. Draken? That's right, Shigo. Kim Possible's computer kid told me how you were at the mercy of a villain. Where is this Aviarius? Here he is! Dude, Draken knows who I am. Yes, the name escapes me, but I do know the air of buffoonery. Dr. D, I've got everything under control here. Hey! Maybe not so much. <gasps> Get us out of here, fast! Can do. And don't worry, Seagull, you can thank me later. I mean, really, you practically gave it to her. Whatever. Now that I know the whole story, I think you secretly wanted to lose. What? That's right. You wanted your brothers to get their powers back. You don't really have it in you to betray them. Are you saying that I am going soft? As a marshmallow. <laughs> Shigo, I take it back. You're not a softie. Shigo! And so, Kim Possible, the time has come for you to... <gasps> Come on, time out! I mean, I haven't even gotten into my gloating yet, for Pete's sake. This is just getting ridiculous. I'll say. I'm serious, Shigo. Kim Possible has foiled my plans for the last time. Yeah, the last time today, maybe. We've been going about this all wrong. By we, you do mean you, right? We have to take the fight to her. I am putting a hold on all Take Over the World ventures until we have eliminated Kim Possible once and for all. But these are all teen magazines. What are you planning to do? Read her fashion horoscope? <laughs> Don't you see, Shigo? Kim Possible is a teenager. These magazines provide a direct portal into the unfathomable mind of the modern teen. To defeat one's enemy, one must first know one's enemy. <laughs> <laughs> we should pick up some milk while we're here. 
Corey's solo career, fat or flat, not remotely helpful. Oh, save me that no chip nails article, would you? <laughs> hey, you try keeping a manicure while kung fuing it out with keen heroes all day. What's your shy cue? <laughs> she go, we're working here. Or unlock the true you. A personality quiz. Number one. When I'm crushing hard on someone, I let them know by A, a flirty email, B, romantic gifts. I don't know, I'd probably employ some kind of mind control device on them. Charming. I'll check other. Oh, please. How about just last week when Kim Possible gave you that flying kung fu wedgie? And you're all like, Chico, help me, help me. <laughs> or there's that time. Silence! My most humiliating moment ever. Embarrassment Central. I could have died from embarrassment. Let me see that. Could have died from embarrassment. Hmm. That's it! That's it, Chico! What is? Embarrassment. The soft white underbelly of the teen ego. Ew. She will literally vanish before our eyes! Question 32. You feel prettiest in A. Pink. B. Purple. Definitely green. I knew destroying Kim Possible would be a hoot, but this is simply to live. Table for two, please. Huh, he's kind of cute. I approve. What are you, her sister all of a sudden? We're trying to vanish Kim Possible from the face of the earth, remember? One heaping helping of embarrassment coming right up. Deep, dark, disgusting food combo. No way. Oops, excuse me, John. Mmm, this is really getting good. Trap, she's on to us. Check, please. Just a few more doses of humiliation and Kim Possible should be gone for good. You didn't happen to borrow those binoculars from the Embarrassment Ninjas by any chance. Yes? Why do you ask? Oh, uh, <clears throat> no reason. <laughs> I am Dr. Draken! MD or dentist? Evil mastermind? On the brink of world conquest? <clears throat> Ring a bell? Isn't that Professor Dementor? Ah. No matter. Chico! Thank you! Hapless henchman will be genetically transformed into a fearless, bloodthirsty predator! <laughs> a problems? I should have it humming along any minute now. They call her D.N. Amy. Chico, I am quite capable of creating a genetically enhanced super army by myself. Thank you. Oh! Oh! Ah! Fine. New plan. I charm this D.N. Amy woman into doing my bidding. What? Nothing. You don't think I can be charming? I didn't say a word. The doctor is making a house call. Watch and learn, Chico. Hello, pretty little. And what have I learned? At least she remembers me. Go away! You stole my genomic sequencer! Ah, uh, yes. Sorry about that. By the way, were you injured? When your girlfriend blasted me? When you fell from heaven. For you are surely an angel. And don't worry, she's not my girlfriend. Flattery will get you everywhere. <laughs> How about into your lab? <laughs> right this way. Watch your step. Now, Shigo, who got game? You got game. Straight up. <laughs> Sorry, Honey Bunny. Ready, Honey Bunny? <laughs> Is it completely necessary to call me that? <laughs> I like Sugar Burger, too. Honey Bunny it is, then. At last, a 
creature so terrifying, so fearsome, so... Ah! What is that? Isn't he just the cutest thing? Precious. My mutant army must be vicious and bloodthirsty. Cute and cuddly won't take over the world. Dragon and Dean Amy together? Kim Possible! You know Kim Possible? She's my arch foe! Well, you know what they say. The enemy of my enemy is awfully cute. <laughs> okay, how weird is this? <sighs> yeah, very. Thank you. <laughs> I think you actually like her. Oh, please. I'm an evil manipulator, remember? She's a pawn in my scheme. Uh-huh, uh-huh. That, and you like her. Do not. Do so. Do not, Infinity. Dragon and Amy, signature dragon. Jingo! The creature will maul her to bits. <laughs> this I want to see. Watch out, Jingo! <laughs> Nothing. Nothing? You risked your life for me. Oh, Amy, no one's ever done that before. Amy, you're the woman for me. <laughs> I knew it the moment I saw you. Oh, Doctor. I love everything about you. Your homemade cookies, your homemade creatures. That way you wrinkle your nose when you flout the laws of man and nature. Oh, Amy, be mine. You're sweet, but the truth is... My heart belongs to another. You what? I did some radical genetic mutation on his hands and feet. Isn't that romantic? I hope we can still be friends. Shake out! In mere moments, Ray X will be ours. What does this Ray X do? It's need to know. Uh-huh, uh-huh. So you don't know. I need to know. That's why we're here. Impossible. Not to worry. I have just the plan to get past her. Choo! Choo! Aw, somebody's sick. This'll be cake. We can't just walk in there. What about the plan? I do it myself. Everyone knows it's impossible to keep your eyes open while you're sneezing. So, if we time it right, she won't see a thing. Okay, fine. I have no idea what this is going to do to you, but I'm banking it's very, very bad. Dragon! I have to sneeze. What? I need to cover my nose. Nice try, Kimmy. <laughs> oh, that was a low blow. Hello? Day. I'm calling it sick. Kim Possible gave me a stupid cold. What? You can't call in sick. I have to go. I, 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 I no! Ugh, that's disgusting. Uh, I need a new temporary cohort and evil ASAP. But who? Who? Yeah, never again. She go. Wow, you look green. I mean, you know, greener. <gasps> oh, oh, total grossness. Like taking candy from a baby. Yes? Hey, can you believe Felicia and Brock switched brains? I know. So does that mean the wedding's off? Looks like somebody's been drinking lots of fluids and retaining every ounce. Gesundheit. Thanks. Come on, Seagull. Show her who's boss. Abacat! Abacat! 
Why am I sitting on an ice cube? So you will divulge every detail of your top secret projects. That's why. You make no sense to me. Welcome to my life. Oh, a little more gluteal discomfort, and you'll be little Miss Busy Lips. I still don't get the ice. Uh, fine, forget the ice. You leave me no choice but to use this. I... Oh, what? Chill a new air dragon. Impossible! We'll build a frozen fortress you'll never find us there. But that ice the sashigo. This had better be worth it. Oh, it is, Shigo. Behind this door is the most top secret substance known to man. If it's so secret, how do you hear about it? Online chat room. You know, you really should spend more time on the internet. Um, no thank you. I've got a life. <laughs> That's what we came for? This container holds all the self-replicating synthoplasma in the world! Huh. Must not be in big demand. It's super concentrated. Just add air and look out. Look out for what? Stuff! You know, bad stuff. But big bad stuff. Don't know what it does, do ya? I do, too. It's just... I... I don't want to tell you. It would ruin the... Surprise! Impossible! And don't forget, Ron's stoppable! Yeah, whatever. Ooh, is that you? Mother? Ooh, what is all this stuff? Is this for your radio show? Radio show? That's right, the radio show. I've got to get back to my callers. Um, hello, listener. Um, my advice to you is to get in touch with your feminine side. Yes! Ooh! Okay, I'm confused. And that's perfectly okay. Those feelings are normal. Mother doesn't know I'm a supervillain. She thinks I'm a radio talk show doctor. My Drew helps people with their problems. <laughs> He's such a good boy. And smart, too. So your mother has no idea that you're trying to take over the world. She'll know when I succeed, won't she? Drew, what does this button do? No, don't touch it! You'll destroy us all! I, um, I mean mother. <laughs> um, you have to be in the union to touch this stuff. We'll meet up with the train here, and then it will all be mine! Aren't you a little old to be playing with your Peter Puffer Puff toys? She's got a point, Choo Choo Boy. <clears throat> Don't you think it's time you settled down and met a nice girl? Oh, um, ick. We really need to bring all of this food? My little boy needs a healthy meal to keep him strong. Isn't that right, Ruby? <gasps> Drooby? Mother, we agreed. No Drooby. I'm a big boy now, remember? Oh, but you'll always be my Drooby. Now give Mama a great big huggy! Uh, not in front of my radio crew. Drooby? <laughs> Are you sure you know where you're going? Yes, Mother. This is a global positioning device. I know exactly where I'm going. Mm. Uh, Dr. Dragon. Ah! Mm, never mind. What's that? It's for men on the street interviews. And um, where's the street? Zip a lip, she go. Ah! Only one person could have done that. Impossible. Oh, is she one of your friends? Hmm. Uh, it's a complicated relationship, Mother. Come, we have to catch that train. This Kim must be some special girl, huh? Looks like you missed your chance with my boy, honey. Oh, boy. Yo, you're right. How will I ever live with myself? And so, Kim Possible and her... Sister? Hmm? Is he hitting on me? Nah, sidekicks really confuse him. Ahem, ah. Uh, with the tied up, please pay attention to the... Tire upper, you have been a bee in my bonnet for far too long. Prepare to meet Drew? my mother. Peter Pufferpuff's approaching the giant gorge. You're loving this, aren't you? I could use some coffee. Does this train have a dining car? Drewby, are you listening to me? Mother! Drewby? Precious, isn't it? Finally. The most secret substance in the world is mine! Drew, you lie! There's no dining car on this train! Is that what I think it is? A thermos of coffee! Oh, such a good boy! I'll go get the pie from our picnic basket!
basket, okay? Huh? Lose something? We parked the hovercraft up here somewhere. Yeah, but at that end of the train. Ah, oh, swell, the gelatinous mask ate it. Do you know how much that thing cost? It wasn't cheap. Fine, we'll keep the train, lose the passengers. What about your mother? I went back to the pie! My mother? I forgot about her! Uh. Uh. Money! Luca! Bread! Dinero! Scratch! Don't rain me! Uh, it's the bane of my existence! I'm sorry, what's the problem, Dr. D? Operation Catastrophic Doom has run into massive cost overruns. I have no choice but to resort to drastic measures. Attention! This year's Evil Family Picnic has been cancelled! Oh. Fine by me. You in the pie eating contest? Not pretty. Five-time champ, Shigo! In your face! Actually, in your face. I think you still have a little blueberry schmutz right there. No, right there. That's my skin! Thus ends phase A. Now, in phase B... Da -da -da -da. If I can get this plan on track, will you shut up? What do you need? A very large diamond. Done. I know exactly where to steal one. At 12.8 million, it's a steal! No. When you steal it, it's a steal. Hey, Mr. Ding, they're evil. Oh, just because I do bad things, that makes me evil? Uh, yeah, you're a villain. Oh, you teenagers think you have it all figured out. Sometimes there are shades of gray. Not in this case. No, but I'm just saying that... Ding out! What's with the posse? Ron's rich. Define rich. Just south of billionaire. Really? Maybe I'm on the wrong side. Yeah. <gasps> of my foot! Afford to build a new laser? Well, I could if you'd lend me the cash. Say a million or forget it. Oh, come on, Shigo. I'll let you rule Greenland. Think about it. That's a lot of land. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yeah, Greenland's the icy one. You knew that? I want Iceland. The green one? <laughs> Fine. What are you going to do? Go with my strengths. Yeah. Your sidekick bought you a squad? Uh, yeah. Man, I am on the wrong side. Sorry, Kimmy. Gots to follow the money. Defensive positions. Oh, cute. Hi. Would you accept a generous bribe? Mm -hmm. mm, yes. This is not what I meant. I prefer to surround myself with genuine friends. Take Shigo, for instance. Faithful, loyal... Yo, Dr. D. Come on. Come on, come on. Wait. I'll make a withdrawal. Hey! Hey, hey! It's a start. All right, let's get this operation too complicated to actually work over with. Hey, this could be fun. How about I use the laser cannon to vaporize you clowns? send you a postcard from Iceland, but they don't deliver mail where you're going. Now that's just great. Now how am I going to start Operation Catastrophic Doom? You still got Stoppable's money? Yes, but... Yeah, we'll discuss it in Reykjavik. New Evil Lair, $34 million. New Laser Cannon, $48 million. Operation Catastrophic Doom! A colossal waste of money. Shh! And now begins the reign of Dr. Draken! Colossal waste of money. There you go. No Iceland for you. 
Wait, let me guess. Previous tenant, Professor Dementor? No, it's someone named Demens. Doi, that's Dementor's real name. He uses a fake name? Yeah, can you imagine? Drew Lipsky. Can it be? What? It would be an uncanny coincidence. What? Uh, if this is what I think it is. What? It's a Lipsky family legend. I must possess it. This thing is like a hundred years old. Why are you interested in it? Because, Shigo, the electrostatic illuminator is the reason I became a villain. <laughs> Dr. D, I thought you became a villain because of the guys who teased you in nerd school. Well, thank you for harshing my mellow, Shigo. Now quickly, to my mother's attic! I'm, I'm gonna go, but I am not sure why. And when the electrostatic illuminator is mine, the whole world's there will bow before me! Oh, I could listen to this over and over. I never could crack the mystery as a child, and yet it inspired me so. I was quite the evil little dreamer. <laughs> I have succeeded where my ancestor failed! Yeah, what are the chances that he'd swoop in and save us at the last minute? The staggering power of the electrostatic illuminator is mine! Wait a minute, wait a minute. Since when do you win? I guess I'd better return the favor. There must be a catch. Hey! <laughs> Impossible! You think you're all that, but you're... Ah! You... you saved us. It's a hero thing. Well, this is awkward. We must never speak of it again. <laughs>